Hi Cancer, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do another reading for February. Um, yeah, so this is for any time in February. Really, I'm aiming it for mid-February, but whenever it resonates. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Um, just take what resonates and leave the rest, okay? Um, you guys need to breathe. Just breathe. I don't know why I have to tell you that. But you may come into some conflict this at this time in which you need to take a minute to just breathe. You know, breathe before you um, react. Okay? We're going to get one of these, one of these, and we're going to use that deck right there. What do we have for Cancer? Cancer. Authority. Authority. Yeah. This is the Emperor. Um, this is about um, remaining in control. So yeah, you're going to have to remain in control. I feel like you're going to be faced with a dilemma. And the emperor is the person that is looked at to bring order to a situation. So you may have to really control yourself at this time. I, something, I feel like there's going to be an instance where, you know, you're going to have to be disciplined. All right. And you're going to have to really take the lead in a situation. Um, really use your inner wisdom at this time to restrain yourself to make the best possible decision so that you can have the best possible outcome. Okay, This is telling me that you're the boss. You're the boss. Whatever that means, you are the boss. One more card for Cancer. You're going to have to be strong. Look at how strong this person is. And we got a four right here. Four is an angel number. So you are being guided, okay? This is a card of protection as well. So, you know, maybe you need ask your angels for guidance. I don't know, but... Uh, Oh my God, if everybody gets this card, I can't even believe it. Now you're the fourth one. Taurus got this. Virgo got this. And I think Sagittarius got this. So this is in regards to a partnership. It's like everybody is getting this card. So we have a partnership that is definitely being questioned okay wow I can't even believe it I mean I can't believe it when we get to keep getting the same cards over and over and over again I have to show you what's on the bottom we have a new beginning here I think Taurus got this one too maybe you're dealing with a Taurus I don't know I don't know somebody got this um, you could also be dealing with an Aries anyhow um, we have a new beginning here. Birth of a new life. Maybe it's a birth of a new partnership. I don't know. What do we got for cancer, dear God, angel, spirits, and universe for the month of February? What do we have for cancer? What do we have for cancer? I'm not going to take those. What do we have for Cancer? Yeah, you're going to have to be patient, okay? I think you're going to be forced with a dilemma that tests your patience, okay? There could be a partnership that is rocky. We could have a rocky partnership here 
that people aren't two people aren't seeing eye to eye and you know maybe you need to make some compromises maybe you know you're trying to blend you're trying to blend this opposition somehow you're trying to keep things together but this is incompatibility I mean the two of cups reverse that's incompatibility so You know, the temperance is a card of change, transition. Maybe you're beginning to realize you're not compatible with a person. I don't know. We're going to find out. We're going to get a bunch more cards. pain here the ten of swords a painful ending you guys may uh, be dealing with a relationship that is really it could be ending okay I'm just being honest with you here maybe somebody has changed maybe somebody has evolved maybe they're not the same person anymore you gotta see what's under it's like we have a union that is in conflict okay it's in conflict and you probably have a better opportunity and you probably see that you have a better opportunity or somebody has a better opportunity somebody that's better suited right somebody that you have really a lot in common with is on the outside of this situation Maybe some of you are still healing from a partnership, a union that fell apart. This is healing. Ooh, the emperor reversed. Wow. So things have been out of control. Something may be spiraling out of control. And you are needing to find your patience to deal with this the most. Um practical way okay yep there you are you're gonna have to master your emotions and you're the boss like I said you're in control of this situation this does have to do with somebody from your past And it's about reevaluating the past. It's about reevaluating the abundance that you had in the past, or reevaluating the reevaluating re the pain. Period. It's like that pain is going to become right up to the surface for some reason. But you're the king of the road here, and here we have the opposition. It's funny. I think I mentioned opposition at the beginning of this reading. It's really dealing with the opposition. I feel like you are going to be faced with some opposition this month. <laughs> yes, you are. Some opposing forces, and it could be with somebody from your past. Okay. Um, it's definitely going to bring up memories of the past or a partnership of the past, something like that. And this is recognizing with the Six of Wands, recognizing, I don't know, because this is replacing fear with faith. Recognize, and this is victory and success. This is recognizing, and this is victory and success. And now we have another six. So six, six, six. This is a time of reevaluating your past. And taking back control. That's why that emperor is here in 666 is taking back control. Taking back control of a situation. Really taking the reins. Taking the lead. It's like you guys are headed in a new direction. And things are probably happening very fast. I think you're transitioning out of something. You're transitioning. Maybe you're transitioning out of one partnership and reconnecting with your past. What the hell is this? Somebody is recognizing that oh 
God, what the hell are they recognizing? This nine of pentacles, that's lack of, a, like, lack of abundance. Lack of worth. So maybe somebody is recognizing that they had a better suitor or they had a good suitor. is and they they made a wrong choice I mean the seven of cups is some sort of illusion some sort of choice over the six of cups reversed about the past somebody made a wrong choice I don't know maybe it was the other person I don't know It's like now I think that somebody is realizing that there is hope. For a new beginning. What the hell? This is hope. Could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Aries is pretty prominent here. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, this is moving on. This is taking the leads. This is a transition, okay? We do have a... This is transition, this is transition, this is transition. Transitioning from a... unprosperous situation towards wish fulfillment. And I think you're in the process of making a decision as to whether you want to go back to the past or you want to choose another option. I think you have multiple options here, Cancer. And the past could be the one that's recognizing your worth. Just saying. Somebody is recognized, somebody that is watching this reading is recognizing another person's worth when they didn't see it before. Yes, it's like they're seeing the situation clearly now. Reality check. So, yeah, I feel like you are being put right in the driver's seat. And you have the ability to take control of a situation that really hurt you in the past. It's the end of the storm. That's, I mean, it's like the end of the, I don't know if the storm is the right word. Darkness. It's the end of the darkness. It's like there's an ability to really regain regain the lead. Regain the structure, regain the authority, regain something where you get back in charge, where you take the lead again. We have a really good opportunity that is well suited for you on the outside of this situation that could lead to wish fulfillment. But somebody hasn't really been focused On making the right choice. I feel like somebody has been putting all their attention in their money, their job, their, their business, their whatever. Everything but love. But now we have this opposition from the past that needs to be dealt with. Because it's time. This is divine timing. It's time. It's time to face reality of a situation, whatever it is. Time to face your fears. And I think that's what this is. This is replacing fear with faith and hope. And moving quickly in the right direction. So I feel like somebody is traveling towards somebody. They're traveling towards somebody from to their past. 
traveling. This is the Six of Cups. Hey, man. It's like facing the fears for sure. No longer going to, you know, be stuck. I'm not going to be stuck here. I'm ready. I'm ready. I, I've been enlightened. It's like somebody is taking off the the strings, you know, I'm cutting off the strings. I'm I'm breaking free from this old mentality. And moving forward very very quickly. I see that there is I think there's a somebody that has been trying to prove a point and they've come to the recognition or the realization reality check that there's nothing to prove I don't need to prove it anymore <laughs> whatever that means yeah I think somebody is, is has been mentally trapped and wearing some sort of mask that has been keeping them stuck thinking negative thoughts and now it's like it's time to take back control interesting yeah I think that somebody is giving up their stance No more. Not going to put in any more effort to hide the truth. It's like the truth is coming out with that moon card. It's like the secret is being revealed. You can't hide it anymore. It's like this can't be hidden anymore. It's like somebody's been putting so much time and effort into the work that they didn't see an opportunity. And now it's like I see an opportunity for wish fulfillment. And I think it's with somebody from the past, somebody that you've known before. I don't know what the hell this is. Another six. Six, 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 six. Reevaluate. Six is about choices. They're about reevaluation. <laughs> it's the journey towards balance and harmony. So I feel like what's happening here is you guys are taking huge steps to get your life back on track. After not putting in effort, just burying your feelings in perhaps your job, your business, whatever. And now it's like, I got to get my relationship back on track. I got to get my union back on track. So I'm going to have to take the lead to protect what's mine. So I feel like you guys are moving to a much better place really quickly. You're bringing, you're bringing, you're doing what you need to do to bring balance and harmony back to your life. It's like you're taking the reins and you're getting in your vehicle and you're doing what you got to do to succeed. And whatever you're doing is going to lead to victory and success because right in the middle of this reading, we do have the Six of Wands, which is victory and success. I thought that was off. I never turned my phone on, so I don't know how that happened. Weird. Anyway, um, there's a lot of healing that has happened here, Okay. There is. And somebody is seeing a situation completely differently than they did before. And it's like now there's this, there's this new opportunity to... Seriously, there's a new opportunity here with somebody that is really, really well suited for you that could lead to wish fulfillment if you make the right decision. This, this decision. And I think right now you're in the process of making that, com that complex decision. Do you want to go back to the past or not? So right now it's about, this month at this time, it's about getting your life back on track, dealing with the opposition. So I think, and I think the opposition is somebody that you know, somebody that may have been, may have hurt you or you have hurt them. Um, yeah, it's bringing back stability. I want my stability back. Things have been turned upside down, and it's like somebody and it's like somebody's trying to get their stability back. No longer going to resist. I can't resist. You know that saying, what you resist persists, right? Somebody's like, I can't resist that it's time. 
It's time. It's time. This is divine timing. It's time. It's time for this new beginning. And you do. You have a new beginning here. You do. This is, a, this, is, this is something that you can really bank on. It's something that you can touch. This is something that is solid and can last forever. It's so big. It's a big, big, big opportunity. So I think that you have an opportunity to have a new beginning with perhaps somebody that you have known before. And it's after somebody was trying to prove a point and they're deciding that they don't need to have anything to prove anymore. It's about being happy. This is a new solid opportunity. You are being offered a new solid opportunity. And it's like you see it. I think you do see it. And I feel like you guys are finding the mental strength to replace that fear with faith and go after what you want. And I see that you guys are headed right towards victory and success because you're giving up that stance of I, ha of, I have to stay right here. I will not give in. I don't, it's like I, I'm not going to do that anymore. I will give in. I will give in to find wish fulfillment. I'm giving in because this, this leads to wish fulfillment. This is. The hey man standing up, it's like I'm giving in. I'm going to do what I, I got to do to take back control of my life. To bring the stability back. And whatever you're doing is going to bring stability back. Trust me. So I feel like we have a union that is coming about. And I think it's with somebody that you have known before. And you are going to have the authority to make the call. You're in charge here. You are completely in charge. Um, I feel as though <laughs> you're going to receive an opportunity. You have an opportunity for wish fulfillment with somebody that is really good, well suited for you. And this is somebody that you can act actually, you know, build something solid with. It is. Let's get you an angel romance card. I don't know why. Um, or two. Two cards for cancer. It looks like you guys are regaining stability after it's been lost. Regaining stability over a situation. It's like seeing things absolutely clearly about your future. You know, and what you want. It's like, I know what I want and I'm going to get it. You have a new beginning here. And it does lead to a union. It does lead to a union. It's safe for you to love, open your heart to give, and receive the highest energy of all. It is safe. There's hope. This is a time of inspiration. It's a time to go after your dreams. This is a blessing. You're being offered a blessing. It's what you deserve. Whoever this person is, I think it's a perfect match. I don't know why I think that. Could be Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Could be Aquarius. Could be Sagittarius. Um, could be another Cancer. Could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. One more card. Playfulness. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Just do it. Get out there. Flirt. Extend yourself. Be playful. I feel as though there's a almost like a reconciliation of some sort here. I don't know why I think that, but I feel like there is. 
If it's not a reconciliation, it's somebody brand new that is coming into your life. And maybe you're going to feel familiar with them. Like you've known them forever. Because I feel like there's a past life connection here. I do. And I feel like there's an opportunity to, you know, transition from a difficult time right into wish fulfillment. So that's pretty, that's, that's what this is. Okay. And I feel like what's happening is it's all up to you. It's your choice because sixes are about choices too. And this is, you're in control. You're the boss. It's your choice. You have the choice this month whether to go back or to, or whatever, whatever, or either, or to accept a new opportunity. I think that you guys are, have had some sort of spiritual wake up call, and now you're seeing um, the worth, or somebody, or if it ain't you, it's whoever you're dealing with, somebody is seeing your worth, or you're seeing theirs. And there's an opportunity for a union here there is and this union may have already fallen up fallen apart before so I, yeah I feel like there's an opportunity for for real love here there really is open your heart be playful take charge of the situation you're in control you're the boss protect what is yours So anyway, I really feel like you guys have an opportunity for a union this month that is something that you manifested. It's something that, it's a big opportunity, and it's a safe one. It's safe. It's safe. Don't let it go. That's what I have. Good luck.